Well, a couple of our weather trackers cracking the 90 degree mark this afternoon. Jerry Madonna weather for it at 90, 91 from Jack Thomason in Lillian, 88 from the Mulcahy's out in Commerce and 84 degrees the afternoon high in Gainesville. Of course, once again, no rain today. Take a look at this. Uh, look, looking back at the last five months, we've literally been either feast or famine in terms of rainfall here. Not bad in May and June with uh, rainfall just a little bit below average, but then we take a big dip in July with not even an inch of rain. Rebound nicely in August with 4.34 inches. That's over double what we typically see in the month of August. And here we go again, one step forward, two steps back. September only 0 0.06 inches of rain. That's less than 3% of our normal rainfall. Now here's our next hope of seeing rain. It's only a small chance though. This area of low pressure in the upper atmosphere out near the Midland Odessa area will dip down towards the Rio Grande late tonight, then head back off to the east northeast as we head towards the weekend. And based on that track and Gulf moisture slowly but surely increasing, we'll see at least small rain chances here beginning for southern areas tomorrow and the rest of us on uh, Saturday. 87 today's high, 85 the average for this time of the year. Pollen count was high again today. Just ask Steve Eager, ragweed and elm making that up this afternoon. 80 in Dallas. Meantime, it's already down to 70 in Fort Worth, 75 North Richland Hills and Allen. Winds are light east southeast and your dew point at 53. Hometown forecast partly cloudy overnight with low temperatures generally in the low to mid 60s. 66 Dallas, 62 McKinney, 64 in Grapevine. And opening day for the State Fair tomorrow. Gates will open to partly sunny skies around 76, 85 at 3 o'clock in the afternoon and back down to 79 by 8 o'clock. So let's time things out with Futurecast. Here comes that uh, area of low pressure in the upper atmosphere. Could be a few showers to our south later tomorrow afternoon. And then as that low draws a little closer on Saturday, some widely scattered to isolated showers and storms Saturday afternoon into Saturday evening. But our better chance of rain will come with a stronger upper air disturbance that will drive a cold front in here Thursday into Friday with not only scattered showers and storms, but cooler air that will filter in behind it. Full on AccuWeather, 7 day forecast, 87 tomorrow, 88 degrees on Saturday. There's your slight chance of rain back up to 90 Sunday and Monday, low 90s Tuesday and Wednesday, and then the changes start Thursday and Friday with some rain and hopefully cooler temperatures by next weekend.